the south of France is known for its laid-back attitude and beautiful countryside, a place that suits Cyril Asker perfectly. People are different. People are very cool, very easy. We have sun, we have beach, we have mountains. We have, it's very quiet, it's very calm, and uh, it's like redneck part of France, you know? Everybody know everybody. It's a lot of family here. Known for his friendly demeanor, Asker is one of the more easygoing athletes on the EFC roster. He's always smiling, he looks like stress, don't stick to cereal. He got a um, positive attitude all the time, and this is perfect for a coach. Everybody asks me, hey, you happy when you fight? You happy when you are in conf press conference? You happy at the way? I'm happy all here long, bro. I, that's philosophy of life. I'm happy, I'm a happy guy. I'm a smiling guy, <laughs> no problem. But as friendly and laid back as he might come across, it's inside the gym where Asker knows exactly when to turn it on. He's got very good skill. He's good on the ground, his technique is good. I can polish the technique, but um, I think the main job the, uh, is done. For Syria. I do jiu-jitsu and my wrestling is good, my boxing is good. I don't give issue where the go, where the fight will go. I make my fight, I make my plan, and I'm focused about what I do to run on. Asker made his EFC debut in a dominant performance against Ricky Macholas, getting the unanimous decision victory. But it was his fight against the former heavyweight champion, Ruan Potts, that really caught the EFC fans' attention. It's time for Cyril Asker, the young Frenchman, taking on South Africa's own Ruan Banks Potts. Potts trying to shake him off, but Asker's got a good top One, game, two. good top control. Cyril Asker now looking to finish himself. He's landing some big shots. Potts is just covering up. Bertie is going to step in here. He may finish it. Cyril Asker, he's on his way. Can Asker put away Ruan Potts? I, I planned that Cyril will win in the second round. Th that was my, my goal as a coach. I would like to make a second round with me, but I, uh, for sure I will finish him. And, uh, but I was a little disappointed, but I, I'm okay, it's a win. And, uh, Are you guys, he gonna, I don't think he's going to find He's going to verbally submit. It looks like he's done. Potts verbally submit Cyril Asker. There's a new sheriff in the heavyweight division. I am absolutely impressed 125% with this silverback, Cyril Asker. You looked incredible tonight, it has to be said. It, it seems like Graham Quad by the EFC matchmaker has alluded to a potential heavyweight title fight between you and Andrew Pincel. Hey, one gear. You cool man, but I keep my belt fresh. I'm coming for it. When you finish your own parts, I don't think he really did. Um, Again, uh, Ruan in that fight maybe um, was a little bit, uh, a little bit exhausted. It looked like, um, so yeah, he can, he can carry that if he wants. He sort of thinks that uh, the guy he fought was the same guy that Andrew fought. The same Ruan, not good for him. Let him have that confidence. But remember, Cyril couldn't finish Ricky Michelis, and a lot of guys have finished Ricky. So, what does that say about Cyril? With the heavyweight title on the line. Both heavyweight behemoths will do everything they can to get their hand raised. The battle for the EFC Heavyweight Championship starts now. Prepare for the biggest foreign invasion in EFC history. EFC 44. Reigning heavyweight champion Andrew Fonseil is on a one-way collision course with France's heavy hitter, Cyril Asker. Will South Africa's heavyweight hero withstand the French assault? Plus, the undisputed lightweight champion, Leon Maynard, will take on the undefeated Zimbabwean, Temba Garimbo. It's power and precision against speed and aggression for the lightweight championship. And the dominating champion, Boyd Allen, will put national pride on the line as he faces off against the Scottish threat, Daniel Henry. Will the man from the Scottish Highlands take South Africa's gold? EFC 44, Saturday, the 3rd of October, Carnival City. Tickets and broadcast information at efcworldwide.com.